Hi there, it's Denise, how to stay fit over 50.com, how to stay fit after 50 with Denise on Facebook, how to stay fit over 50 with Denise on Instagram, Denise Anger at gmail.com, right here on YouTube. So let's get to chat chatting. Um, this week, I'm going to give you a few tips on how to change little tweaks in your nutrition that'll help you lose um, weight. Now, I want to address that first, weight loss. People get so obsessed with those numbers on the scale, and for many of us over 50, I'm going to be 60 this year, losing weight, no bueno, not easy at all. However, I have, since the beginning of the year, now have been able to lose five pounds, and it wasn't anything major that I did. So I'm gonna to talk to you about that. Um, I'll let you know what I have been doing to lose a couple pounds. And luckily for me, people are seeing it in my midsection, which is definitely where I'm struggling. So what uh, is the cause of it? Well, as we get older, our metabolism changes, our um, muscle, we don't have as much muscle in our body, which muscle helps your metabolism keep moving, um, keep operating efficiently. We, many of us, don't need the same amount of calories that we're used to consuming, and that's a, that's a big part of the picture, along with we're not exercising, we're not as active as we used to be. So talking strictly about nutrition today, a um, couple things that we need to look at. We, this, my water bottle is holding my phone right now while I'm talking to you, but you must, 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 must drink the water that your body needs. And that is 50% of your weight in ounces. You weigh 200 pounds, you're drinking 100 ounces of water. No excuses. There is no, nothing you can tell me to say, for me to say that you don't have to do that. Um, so you pee more, big deal. Go to the bathroom, pee. Um, it not only helps flush everything out, all the toxins out, it also helps you feel full. And many times when we think we're hungry, we're actually dehydrated. It's, uh, I apologize, it's um, kind of chilly here in Florida. My hair, <sighs> staticky, <laughs> so I apologize for that. Um, but back to the water, you may think that you're hungry when in fact you're not hungry. You are actually thirsty. So, but to help myself, my, make sure I get the water in that my body needs. I start first thing in the morning. I drink at least 20 ounces in the morning when I'm taking my vitamins. Um, I just literally down it. I actually am thirsty in the mornings, especially now since I've been doing this for some time. So start in the morning with get yourself a big old cup of water and drink that first before you do anything else. And then make sure you stay on track throughout the day with your water. I walk with my water bottle. Secondly, there's, I'm only giving you three tips today. Number two, increase the protein. I uh, Protein meaning lean chicken, lean beef, pork, eggs, fish. Um, if you're a vegan, uh, veg, well, if you're a vegetarian, eggs. But if you're vegan, you have to really look at that. There are um, many protein replacements that you can incorporate in your diet, but fact of the matter is you must increase the protein that you are feeding, fueling your body with. Protein helps us maintain muscles and helps boost the metabolism and it also makes us feel full longer. So again, that's the first thing now that I eat. And also in the evening, it's the most largest thing portion on my plate. Um, I try not to eat after 6 p.m. That's been another big thing, so that's number three. Limit your evening munching. Try not to eat after, for me, 6 p.m. Uh, now, Monday, Wednesday, Friday, I am at the gym until seven, so I don't get home till 7.30, 8 o'clock. Most of the time, I don't eat. I'm really not hungry because I did do make sure I bring my lunch with me, which I would show you my lunchbox, but it's over there. It has uh, tuna fish in it with a salad. And I'll eat that this afternoon, probably around 4.30, 5 o'clock. If I am hungry later in the evening when I get home, it's only protein. So I would have maybe scrambled eggs 
or if my husband made chicken, I would have chicken or again, tuna fish. I'm really not big on eating beef or pork right now. I stay away from it. It's something to do, it's something in my metabolism has changed and it doesn't taste good to me. I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it doesn't taste good to me. So to recap, number one, you must drink the water your body needs. Half your weight in ounces every single day. Number two, number two, increase the protein. I almost lost track of where I was. Number two, increase the protein in your diet. So you want to be eating lean chicken, lean beef, pork, fish, eggs, and vegetarians. I know there's several um, meat replacements that are high in protein. That's where you want to go. And number three, you have to you have to cut it off at dinner time. No more evening snacks. Those three things literally are the only things I've done this month, and I'm now down five pounds. And that's it. I think the biggest biggest thing is making sure that I'm drinking my water because my nutrition is never really that far out of whack but making sure that I'm drinking the water and not eating after 6 p.m. has made the most difference for me. So I hope that helps you. Um, I will be back on hopefully this week with an additional uh, video number two for Gentle Flow Yoga because if you're tight and achy and your joints hurt, yoga is the best thing you can do for yourself. And um, this yoga focuses on um, plus size senior women um, senior women in general, so it'll help you feel a little bit better working on the joints like our shoulders, our knees, our hips, all those things that ache, especially during the winter time. So I will have another video up for you on that, and then I'll be back next week with another um, health, and, health and how to stay fit over 50 video, healthy, happy, fit, over 50, and just tips and tricks and all that good stuff that we need to incorporate into our days. So I hope you're having a wonderful day. I'll chat with you soon. Bye. Don't forget to hit subscribe. I'll see you next week. Bye.